Hello! Welcome once again to Stuff and Things, where I like to talk about stuff and occasionally even things. I'm your good friend Bradley, and today I have two products to show to you. These were sent to me by our good friends ZLYC. You may remember in the past I've had several journals that they sent me, they wanted me to review. I showed them to you on the channel. They were sort of Midori Traveler's Notebook alternatives. Very reasonably priced and not bad quality for the price. Well, they also have the Pilot Man line. These two products are branded with Pilot Man. These are available on Amazon.com, and I just thought I would do a little test and evaluation, a little mini review, and show you what these guys are. We'll start off first with this. This is their Pilot Man Slim Money Clip Credit Card Holder. This is currently $14.99 on Amazon, and of course, these prices are only current as to when I recorded the video, so they may have changed when you're watching this, but $14.99 currently on Amazon. It is a leather card holder slash money clip. It is available in this sort of tan leather, um, and they also have a black version as well. So you can see here, pretty basic. You have two card slots, you have a money clip. The money clip is removable in case you just want to use it as a card case. Here it is loaded up with some of the things you may put in your credit card holder slash money clip. It has the two card slots. It says that it can hold two cards in each slot, but I easily fit three in each. So there's plenty of room there and they're pretty easy to get in and out. Not a problem at all. The money clip, you can obviously put bills or receipts, so on and so forth. Because this clip is removable, um, well, it can be removed. And sometimes when you're trying to put money in there, the clip wants to jockey around a little bit. Um, it's not a huge deal. You'd have to put a bit of force on it to get it to pull out, but that's something to be considered. In terms of the actual just use, daily use of this product, the ergonomics and everything, it's been fine. I've been carrying this with me for the last week or so. Um, it's very slim, and I like the very slim minimalist wallet kind of design, something I can throw in my front pocket. You've probably seen this, my Saddleback Leather front pocket ID wallet, very slim. I like this a lot and I still use this much of the time. And so this kind of adheres to that same form factor. It's not very bulky at all. In terms of the quality, um, this isn't Saddleback Leather, obviously. This is really nice full grain cowhide. This is a little thinner, um, doesn't quite have the same nap, the same feel that a really nice high quality leather item would have. But again, it's $14.99, so a pretty cheap price. I can't really speak to the durability yet because as I said, I've only had it for a week or two and I've only been using it you know, daily for about a week. But it seems to be well stitched. It seems like it would hold together pretty well. The actual leather itself though, I'm not sure how long that will hold up. But again, $14.99, not bad at all. Next, we have the Pilot Man Refillable Leather Notebook Diary. This is in an A5 size. This is currently $21.99 on Amazon as of the recording of this video. It is 200 pages, so 100 sheets of lined paper. And each page also has a date. Um, let me show you here. You have a little heading where you can have the date, the day of the week, and there's even a little weather icon. So if you're trying to keep track of your daily activities, you can circle one of those, sunny, maybe overcast, a little rain. You can make note of that. This is very reminiscent of the Filofax system. Some of you will be very familiar with. And in fact, the size of these inserts, the pages themselves are around eight and a quarter by five and three quarter inches. And just with the hole spacing and everything, they do seem to be pretty much the same as the Filofax inserts. So I'm pretty sure that you can put in Filofax inserts into this notebook, the A5 size anyway. This is pretty basic. It has a little sheet in the front, personal memoranda, name, address, passport information, um, postcodes, email address, personal details, doctors, stockbrokers, your diner's club membership, uh, birthdays and anniversaries, all that good stuff. So if you wanna fill that out, it has four card slots, one of which is windowed here and a little folder in the inside front cover. And then you do have a pen loop here on the back cover. I was able to cram a Caveco Sport in there. Um, it might be a little more at home with just your typical ballpoint, um, but it is actually pretty roomy and that's a leather loop as well. It has this little clasp in front, which if you just 
you know, shove it through. It's not really going to keep the book closed. You could maybe double it through and go back on itself if you really wanted to tighten this down. Um, I don't know how important that is to you. I know a lot of the Filofax ones actually have snap closures. The leather on this is, I have to say, pretty cheap. It doesn't feel great. Um, it's sort of just a cardstock with a layer of leather over top. This folder, it's already gotten kind of creased a little bit and I haven't really used much of it. You can tell the leather has just been kind of glued over a cardstock. Um, so the quality compared to a Filofax notebook isn't going to be amazing, but a Filofax will set you back probably around $50 depending on where you get it. And this one again is $21.99 on Amazon. So if you are looking for a low cost alternative, maybe you just want to try out the Filofax system, it wouldn't necessarily be a bad idea to pick up one of these folders and then you could buy the Filofax inserts, use those in here, because I know they have all sorts of different layouts for different diaries and things like that that you could try to use and maybe try that out as opposed to paying you know, $50 right off the bat and then not liking the system, this could be a good alternative. So $21.99 on Amazon for this, the Pilot Man Refillable Leather Notebook Diary in A5 size, and then $15 or $14.99 for this, the Pilot Man Slim Money Clip Credit Card Holder. Two products sent to me by Pilot Man for review and to show you Hopefully you enjoyed this little look at these two products. Thank you so much for watching. I've been your good friend Bradley. You've been the audience. This has been Stuff and Things. I'll see you later.